about that? Beat it egg. It should be good now. I think it was slightly loose. It was maybe slightly loose. How is it now? Fuck, no sound, no sound. Shh, shh, shh. There, 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 there. We're getting sound, we're getting sound. It's good, there we go. Right. So this place has food challenges. Most of the challenge are volume challenges, like challenge of like how much fucking meat can you eat? Like they serve you an entire loaf with like multiple steaks in it or something. Only sound, no video. Really? I don't fucking believe you, mate. You're tricking me. But I'm gonna try not to get hit by a car. Uh, we're gonna make our way across. And uh, of course, you s I gave you a vote. I gave you a vote. Which challenge do I do? There were like three really tasty looking big amounts of food challenges and there was one nasty looking spicy challenge. You bastards voted for that one by like a massive margin. Like 75% of the votes were, oh, eat the, eat the spicy one. No, I haven't been here. I also haven't asked if it's okay to stream. But I'm gonna be like, look, you do challenge things. I wanna stream it. And I'll probably say, okay, right? You hear everything but don't see shit. That's probably because you're blind. Okay, that makes sense. Genuinely not seeing anything? Let me check. Oh yeah, that's a bit weird. Is no one seeing anything? Sky is blue, video is fine. Okay, yeah, right. I couldn't see in the preview. See if I can hear it fine. Enjoy my tears, we can see. And, uh, like this challenge is properly real not good. Um, for me at least. I assume when they do it, like I didn't see any limitation like time of day. So I assume they just do it whenever. Thank you. Way to be. Is there like a, uh, please respect our neighbors and leave quietly, all right. So, hmm. Let me show you. Let me show you if they have it. Let's, let me let me let me see if they have it. Because they see it showed it online. I don't see it. I don't see it. It should be somewhere here. Oh wait, there we go. Lads. Claw machine. Yeah, yeah, there's a claw machine, but look, 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 look. There is there is. That picture is the apocalypse cow one, right? Then there's then there's Mother Clucker, defeat the meat, and the afterburner, and that's the one you went for, you bastards. I'm surprised it's only 10:49 though. What's going on? Is that gambling? No, it's like a claw machine. I think we'll be good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're gonna do a, we're gonna do a spicy challenge. I think I'm gonna ask them if I can go outside. I think these are all like, yeah, they're all reserved up, but, oh, this isn't reserved. I can grab that one. Jack, you vote, do we go outside? It's still in Yorkshire, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I like spicy food? It's okay. Do we go outside or do I find a non-reserved table? You choose, you tell me. No, 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 it's not flaming like that. You're being very naughty and watching it work. Oh yeah, go outside. What, where I belong, Cobalt Cat, yeah. Go outside, go outside. Yeah, well, it's quite in here. Hey, uh, can I can I order some food, please? Uh, I just want to sit on one of the benches outside. I didn't see you. Yeah, I'll be the room. yeah, I'll be the only person out this. <laughs> um, can I get that food challenge? That's the afterburner, that spicy one. Awesome. Uh, no, just just as it comes, the, the default. Yeah. I'm gonna have people watching me and they're probably gonna consider that cheating. So, no, no drinks, thank you. I'll probably grab one afterwards though. No, thank you. I'll just, uh, I'll just disappear outside. You're not okay with me having a glass of water? Well, I wouldn't think so. No, I wouldn't die. No, actually, water's kind of worse, though. 
Water is actually really bad though. It makes things worse. It makes it makes it like it just it sort of gives you false hope, right? It sort of gives you false hope. And makes makes you think things are gonna feel better when they're really not. No cheating, no safe swimming. Yeah, milk like I could have gotten like a pint. And that would have helped loads, but that is definitely cheating, right? Yeah, water makes it worse. 100%, 100%. You need you need something like milk that uh, does something to it, or freaking booze. Booze uh, destroys the capsaicin connections or whatever, right? Right? Oh, drink salt water. That sounds like a trap, but that sounds like it's just gonna hurt the hell out of me. Water spreads around the mouth. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh yeah, chat, look at this. Are you proud of me? Ask her for eggs and crack them in a glass where I don't get scream. I am out to basic. Uh, I kind of am though. Why do you think? Why do you think I'm doing okay despite having been briefly homeless? I mean, I'm I'm basic. No, how to basic? Fuck. I'm basic. I'm the, I'm the basic egg bitch. Yeah, whatever. Perfection, looking clean. Yeah. The first one's always real hard and real rough, and now I just need to keep now I just need to keep the maintenance up. Egg returns. So my thought was. Okay, if I beat this, like, it doesn't matter how long it takes, if I eat all of this, I'm allowed to go and get a scoop of ice cream from the, like, really nice ice cream place that's supposed to be nearby. Uh, this place isn't too far away from where I'm staying, like, I have to take a couple buses, but still, um, it's a, it would be a pain in the ass to come out again to check out the ice cream, so I'd like to check out the ice cream after this, yeah? Fries, rice, poppadoms, and sour cream. No biggie, you whiny egg. What do you mean? No, you don't understand. I bet it's I bet it's like sour cream with extra spices on it. I bet it has extra spices on it. You accept the deal. What do you mean you accept the deal? I was I'm thinking about that for myself. Unless you want to buy the ice cream. If you buy the ice cream, fuck yeah, I'm into that deal. Couldn't even finish yesterday's burgers. No, but that was that was like a nastiness challenge. That wasn't spicy. I'm sure this will be good. Normally, like. The, the so so like the the best the <laughs> thank God for having just one arm wing yeah, yeah yeah it's true but the best is when it's like a small pub and it's like a gastro pub with with like a head chef who like designs everything uniquely this is like part of a chain but the good thing of being part of a chain is like it's always all right is like never it's never gonna be bad it's always gonna be like all right. This is, there's quite a bit of it. The the other ch the other challenges are like massive amounts of food. This one isn't quite as much, but this is spicy. This is Naga Jalakia, which I think is otherwise known as ghost pepper. Although some people, for some reason, call, some reason people call Scotch bonnets ghost peppers, but they're not, it's Naga Jalakia. Have I tried the game you worked on? I haven't yet. You'd love to see me play it on stream sometime soon. Well, that's probably not gonna happen, I'm sorry to say. I'm sorry to say, it's just not going to work out. Like the the um, I can't get the upload from my laptop consistent enough with my 4G or with the with the house's connection to do it. And like, dude, it's, it's a real noisy house. There are like three kids and two other adults. And like, if I was going to do it late late at night, I'd bother them. Uh, but what I can do is make videos, right? The people cross the street when I walk towards them. Uh, they don't, but people are interested in it. Thank you. Here we go. Here's what I can do, though. Okay, here's what I can do, though. Dude, this is really warm. This is like a really warm pot of cutlery, and it's clean. And I had the goybees. Not right now, but I work, I'm, I'm staying at the goybees. Stream while you're on a fucking mat. I did it a bit later than all, but the, the ice cream shop closes at five. Meredith is cooking every night. So like if I'm gonna do nighttime stuff, it's probably gonna be like having dinner at home and then going out and then going out and uh just drinking and <laughs> fucking with people, which might not be a good idea. There are a ton and there are shit tons of um in in Rotherham town centre, just so many pubs, it's retarded, we can do that. Did I invite Pretzel Girl and sadly not? Sadly not. I should have. I should have. What we got here? We got 
rich and smoky barbecue. We've got the normal, we've got the normal ketchup. We've got a big, we've got a big container of mayo. A big old container of mayo might be what I use because it's okay to use condiments to call it that, right? I'm allowed to do that. And like you can see, it's got the branding. Maybe I should have ordered the naan because I was thinking like it's cheating if you get more bread, but then it adds more volume to it. I don't know. I don't know what I should have done. I just did what I thought was right, okay? Rather than center. Yeah, the, where you go to collect the kids. No, no. The, the, the town center, right? So gay being is the one behind old rapes, yeah. yeah he's, just, he's just all day and night, he's just out raping. I haven't seen him once, he's just out raping. Non-stop, it's unbelievable. Uh, I don't know how he gets away with it. I guess guess when he says like he's Nordic, like when he's he's like, oh, I'm from I'm from up north in continental Europe. But they assume that means he's an Arab, so leave him alone. Play during an IRL stream. Chat doesn't need to see it. You just want to get my opinion on it. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Like the ideal thing for that would be like if it could be on a tablet, or, or like when the when the weather's better, I could go to a Starbucks or find someone that has good good Wi-Fi that lets you connect to, and just bum off their Wi-Fi and do a gaming stream in like a cafe. That would be pretty cool, right? Would I get kicked out? If I got kicked out, it'd be funny, though. Or, like, I could try not to get kicked out of a place like that, right? <laughs> New Scandinavian. After Irish. After Irish, the most prevalent kind of gene in my body is uh, Scandinavian. Free Wi-Fi is too shit. There are some places that are all right, though. You just said that. I didn't see it. Look, the... the, the the shine on my screen is a bit funny, okay? The chat does need to see it. Yeah, chat definitely wants to see it, right? I'm, I'm going to admit that I'm not... This is Nimi. I looked at the, the like developer's page, and the design on the page isn't so good. So maybe the game will be good, but that's just like... They didn't look at designing the page and making it look nice. But I'm a bit, I'm a bit wary. I'm going to tell you the truth. I'm a bit wary of this game. I'm not sure it's going to be great. And... And... You might be upset if I hate it, so just make sure, make sure you're okay with that. A, if you have an internet cafe around, and B, if you can stream from there. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's an idea that's been thrown around a bit, and I could try it. If you go to internet cafe, they expect gamers. True, but they're not really such a... thing? It, there was one in Oxford. I'm not sure there'd be one in Rotherham. I'm not feeling it. Maybe in Sheffield, which isn't, which is like another couple bus rides away. But yeah, not in, not in Rotherham. I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling. It. This isn't the place. This is like, this is like a place full of people who want to pretend that tablets don't even exist. They want tablets to not even exist. Yeah, like a real concept. Your game was out. <laughs> I'm the first victim. So the Irish conspiracy is true. Are you saying the red pill is fake? It definitely is. The Irish control everything, basically, and they um, they have their system even even more tightly tightly wound than than the Jewish system of claiming people because they have a Jewish mother. Uh, the Irish will claim a pub because someone who had an Irish ancestor at some point works there. It's it's pretty tight. Do I ever go to the north? Go to the north. I'm in the north, dude. I'm in Yorkshire. South Yorkshire, but whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Oh shit, I'm bold. Yeah, I'm meant to be. Like, I'm meant to be. Stay bold like I'm supposed to be. Cafe Flair of Rotherham. Salam Cafe Sheffield. Cafe Flair of Rotherham. I'll have to check that out then. Uh, there is a very nice looking Indian place nearby as well. There are a couple of really nice Indian places nearby, actually. One of them's actually kind of fancy, and it's like, oh, you must have a reservation, and you have maximum two hours table time. But they do this... I get the vibe that they're a place that isn't really that high-end, that's pretending to be high-end, because the prices... One, the prices aren't that high. Two, they do the whole... They're, like, copying the higher-end restaurants where, like, tables have a maximum of blah, 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 so please leave promptly and be prepared. But then they also say, be prepared to wait a long time because everything's prepared fresh. You can't do both of those. That's real shitty. Oh, you might have to wait a long time. By the way, there's a time limit on your table. No, that's, that makes me feel like I'm uh, under pressure. That's, that's how to create a terrible eating environment. It's going all right, man. How are you? 
How are you? I've got a uh, I've got a handful of pins YouTube channel set up by the way, and it's got two videos on it. One one is one is the Krispy Kreme review. The other one is the day I did the cheeky Nando's. So yeah, that's fair. But there's also um, what was I going to say? If I ever end up getting banned from Twitch or something something else goes wrong with Twitch, I have a laptop that will let me reconfigure my uh, decon reconfigure my encoder. To, to upload to YouTube instead of Twitch, so I've got that ready, and I can just, like, freaking, Dude, I can just... Um... Stream on YouTube if something goes wrong. Watch them already, cool. What's the channel called? Dude, it's just Harmful Opinions YouTube channel. It's just Harmful Opinions YouTube channel now. Egg lockdown is over, over, yep, it's over. I'm preparing to hop around if I get in trouble. Uh, I need to put the link on here, but you should get to a searching harmful opinions, or go to go to twitter.com slash cyberharm. Even if you don't use Twitter, you'll see on my profile that, like, there's a link. There's a link there. Yeah, man. That, that would be the one, then. And if you go to there, you can, um, you can say, yeah, well, and on. Uh, I was, I was having trouble finding my own account, but I figured maybe that was because I was log in. Log, log in? Logged in? Thank you very much for doing the links, dude. How did I loophole the YouTube ban? I didn't. <laughs> I'm just hoping not to get banned again. Just fingers crossed that like no one's gonna try and like tattle on me. Um, <laughs> there's some decentralized streaming service I've been looking at that I can use after that as well, and whatever. Doesn't pop in that search. Yeah, it takes a while. Like the channel has to be sort of established. That's one of the worst things about like like even even the ones I deleted again. Like the cyber and cyber violence, they weren't showing up properly in the search yet either. Kiza, how's it going, my man? You all right? Big Lenny, call it IRL harm. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Hmm. Got on you as well. Probably a good idea. Do they have a streaming service? I know Gab is looking at more streaming stuff. That might be good. That might work well. I imagine I'd be pretty damn safe. Uh, find IRL. Don't do end stream hosts. Seems the best way to keep from offending the wrong person. Yeah, that's true. Uh, end stream hosts would probably be fine if it's if it's like if it's like a group of people I know. Microsoft's own Twitch clone mixer, you can try that. I've talked to the customer service, and they seem pretty damn chill. They seem pretty damn happy for me to do what I want uh, on there. Uh, DTube, DTube is that the decentralized one? Because if it is, I've been looking at that. The one that's just launching a, a streaming service? There's someone else who gave me a link to another one that's decentralized streaming service. And they said normally it will cost money, but they'd slip me in for free and it's like closed and stuff, so I might have to look at that. It is a loophole because they gave you a new account with your old one. Ah, brilliant, yes. Oh, that looks great. Enjoy. Thank you very, very much. This actually looks fucking good. It actually looks really good. Look at this. Lads, lads, how's that? How's that for a lunch? How's that for a lunch? Giant clam? No, dude. This is a um. This is a poppadom. This is a poppadom. Dom, you can get your own domain and server costly, but little chance you get shut down for bullshit. I'd have to go hardcore. This is... Oh, no. Mother of God. They've got a chili in it. Bull chili. Thank you very much, Evan, for a big old salvo, please. They've got... No, they've... This isn't... Okay, this isn't a spicy chili, though. This is a decorative... This is like a decorative one. The long ones... Are like, um... Ghost peppers are tiny. What's well, a tortilla thing? What do you mean, tortilla thing? It's a poppadom! It's... A, I'll, I'll, I'll give you a... I'll give you some poppadom ASMR, okay? Ready? They're really good. Who hasn't seen a poppadom? Apparently a lot of these lads. These are the spiciest of boys. The spiciest ones. What is it? It's like, um... I don't know how they make it, but it's like a fried Indian bread thing. But it's crispy. The giant Indian chip. I want to eat everything that isn't spicy first. <laughs> Crusty tortilla, yeah. We've got a big load of wangs. We got some sour cream. 
Don't know why you dip a chip in that, but I did. Oh, why not? Eating George Papadopoulos. Make friends with that guy's dog. It does look like a friendly dog. I'll have to go see hi afterwards. Tactical error? I don't think so. Grievous mistake? How? How is it a mistake? Because there's not much non-spicy stuff. There are just some chips and there's some rice. That's it. Right? And when you get into the unleavened crisp bread, cool. When you get into the super spice level, okay, the thing that gets you is that the the feel the sensations against your tongue of things pressing feel like they're cutting you. That's the bad thing. And I'd rather like after I get into the spiciness, I'd rather just have less to put on my tongue, right? I'm gonna go from unspicy to slightly spicy to super spicy. Yeah? My suffering makes your wrinkles go away, I'm glad. I'll tell you what. Hello, I'm Giant Tree. I want to get my passport and my moon back to the US. I'd like to. Oh, I've been in contact with the embassy, they're helping me. They've said what I need to do is is I need to go through it, okay? I need to go through it as if as if my passport is lost or stolen. And they will sort me out. Am I good with spicy? No. Mmm. Peshwari naan is really good. I could have bought a naan for extra, but I didn't want to. Um Peshwari is the coconut and sultana, or like coconut and raisin one, right? Ketchup with curry, you beg me stop. No, dude. I'm eating the bits separately. So it's fine. It's fine, alright? Can you see the food alright? It's nothing like Nando's. This is not microwaved. This is not microwave rice even. You can tell it's been boiled. Like it's 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 legit. Like it might not be the most flavorful rice, but it's but it's definitely not microwave. Mm-hmm. Chat told me one our US embassy is one of the few government functions that are actually helpful, yeah. Uh in case anyone doesn't know, this is their afterbirth afterbirth. <laughs> Yeah, this is a crispy fried placenta. This is the afterbirth challenge. Uh, the baby's in the metal bucket, freshly aborted. Um, I don't know why this is still eating. No, this is the afterburner challenge, okay? Weatherspoons, no. This is a flaming grill pub. It's a it's a chain like Weatherspoons is, but it's a flaming grill pub. <laughs> okay, they do challenge meals, all right? <laughs> I mean, people do, people do eat the placentas, right? They get them ground down into pills, or they cook them in wine. They want. I'd rather eat a child, just because I I know this is gonna hurt. I bet it'll be tasty though. Like it smells really nice. It smells real nice. Right. What do you get if you win the challenge? Nothing. They haven't gone full. They haven't gone full America, right? They've got challenge. They've got like cha a list of challenges, but they don't have like win a T-shirt or anything. Conservative coder, thank you very much. Having for our salvo, please. Hey, Daddy. Hell yeah! Thank you so so much. Subscriptions are my lifeblood now. Feed me more. Feed me more. <laughs> Proper egghead is back. Yeah. I did cut myself. I did cut myself on the back of the head, but you can't see it, so it's fine. So it's absolutely fine. Right. Let's give this... I'm going to give this a little dip dab. I'm going to give this a little dip dab. I'm going to go for the spiciest one and give it a taste. Oh yeah, that's hot. Fuck me, yeah, that's hot. Your resub didn't make a sound. Fluffy Phillips. Did it have the thing that let you put the message in? 
try it again. Fluffy Phillips, thanks for the resub. Everyone for a salvo, please. If that didn't work, there you are. Okay. I can feel it tingling. I had the tiniest bit of it. I'm going to feel it tingling. I think going through all the non-spicy stuff first is the best strat. Here's a big pile of, here's a big pile of yellow. Why not combine the bread with the rice and the hot sauce? I... Uh, it's a balance, okay? It, you, you have to think about what you're... Pre oh, God, look at these seeds. There's so many seeds on this chicken. But, um... You have to decide. Do you want to dilute the spiciness with rice? Or do you want to get the spiciness over with last and have the minimum amount of solid food touching your tongue while it's spiced up? That's what I prefer. That's what I prefer. Pardon me. Do these have cumin? They taste... They taste cumin-y, but I don't see any cumin seeds or anything. No hot first. No, we ain't doing hot first, lad. Oh. Blend it all together. Nah, boy. I'll tell you what. Oh, yeah, that's it. This is Fluffy Phillips. There we go. Wait for it to trigger. Wait for it to trigger. Spicy shiitake. I will. Okay. You know this is going to be rough because you smell it, and it smells very strongly of vinegar, which means it's probably a hot sauce with a lot of extract in it that they're covering up with vinegar, right? <laughs> so it's going to be painful. It's tasty as hell. <coughs> it's extremely tasty. Well, yeah, it's hot. Proper, um... Proper wax your back, back of your throat one. Proper, proper heavy boy, heavy heavy hitter. Uh, here, I know I have rice. No, I changed my mind. A subscriber said, "Start with the spicy stuff." So I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing it for you. Yeah. So much better than yesterday's food. There's no excuse. There's no excuse for yesterday's. Is it being social eating or speed runs? This is just survive. Because I don't do with hot, well with hot stuff. Oh. Oh. Yeah. You can't go wrong with a chain pub. Alright, you can't. You can go wrong with normal chains like Frankie and Benny's. Cannot go wrong with a chain British pub. Oh. Yesterday I went to Frankie and Benny's and got three sliders. And the burger was like fetid. The burger was crispy on the outside. And like, like tofu. It was like fake meat. But it had that bird's eye frozen burger flavor. Looks like they've um, they've deep fried them and given them a shaken sauce. Is what it feels like. No, dude, that was not a cheap place, dude. Seven pounds for three tiny burgers is not cheap. That is not cheap. That is overpriced. What? Even chub, chub pains. Chub pains? Pub chains. <sighs> I can tell that this isn't terribly hot, but it's still getting to me already. I can, it's still getting from such a lightweight when it comes to heat. Nah, it makes a big difference. Yeah, that's for sure. 
Yes, I hold these bones. I'll leave them here for him. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Get rid of the snot. I feel like this is a trap to like get me to put my hands near my face, but I agree. Okay, none of it went in my eyes. No way. My... By the way, you want to say the burgers at that place were cheap? Three tiny burgers with a tiny amount of chips. That was like seven pounds. This whole big thing, tenner. This whole big thing is a tenner. This is what I call like good price, cheap, cheap amount, cheap for a like large amount of food. This is what I call cheap. Couple more of these bad boys. Uh, I'll try not to touch eyes, yeah. Gotta rip it and grip it. Rip it and grip it. There's a big load of the spice. Oof. Used to the spice, not quite. No. And these aren't the spicy bit. These are the middly bits. The spicy bit is in that bowl. Oh, how have I been? I've been alright, rubber band, except for the whole homelessness thing. Pardon me. Holy fuck. Rip and grip abortionist, yeah. Ceiling is heavens. Will it lose the bow? Um, no. I don't think so. Maybe? There's one of two people. Oh. Okay, chat. I found Hug Crew to live with, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna have a knock off a big load of points. A huge pile of points are going to be knocked off. I'm still going to eat it, but this knocks off a ton of points. I don't know what the quality likes or if the quality is like of this puts it in focus. No, nah, this is making me this is making me switch around my words. Can you see it? Can you see what I'm showing you? Is it in focus? Ah. <sighs> I if I meat. No, dude, it's a fly. I'm okay with eating a fly, but like, if it's not intended, that's generally seen as bad. See, it's a little fly. A little, little, little sucker fly. Yeah, I wonder the screen. No, it's not. It's a tiny fly on the chicken. Oh. <sighs> Take it in, get free stuff. Nah, 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 nah. There are two more of the normal ones. Okay. Before I get to the bonus ones. The bonus ones can go down like nothing. Zindamine, shut your mouth. I'm barely surviving as it is. Hmm. It is painfully tasty. It is really nice. Hmm.
Can I even cook? Yeah. I'm co I'm confident saying the rice is not microwaved. Okay. Uh, one more full wing. Uh, one more full wing. Then we get onto the tendies. Yeah. One more full wing, then tendies. Then the hot stuff. Okay. Sticky opinions. <laughs> Carcinoma on the rice. No. Oh, I don't know. Maybe saffron. They just call it yellow rice. Who the fuck microwaves rice? Nando's does. <laughs> on my dick. No, I ain't touching that. Oh, this is a delectable one. Extra crispy. Yeah, there are going to be nose dribbles. Deal with it. my nose. Dude, with this, oh, it's risky, Bill. There's a tiny, clean corner. It's either going to get much better or much worse. This makes the Holocaust look like a prank, to be honest. Ovens in my ass. This is a hot stuff. <laughs> there you go, Synthamine. Where's Ziva's bib? That would be good for me, right? Probably what I need. Okay, I'm gonna be strategic and controlled. Only touch one side. That is the dedicated booger cloth, okay? <sighs> Lube's hottest wing stuff sauce. Dude, I've had, I've had, I've had hot stuff. To me, this is hot enough for me. I'm not even onto the hot one yet. Mm. Oh, that feels good. Competitive nose blowing, yeah, exactly. There's no spoon, so I'm just gonna use my hand. You know it's not that hot when this is providing really a zero to you how hot when the wings. Probably, if I'm gonna be realistic and honest, they're like a four. That's hard for me, but I think proper oh. I think like proper spice psychos would call that a four, yeah? I did shave. Use the tortilla, that's a good idea. I normally use them for the meat, but hey, I can use them for the rice. Oh. There you go, cheers. Cheers, chat. Here's to us. Mm hmm. I have, um... Whoa. I have can cancer of the, uh, cancer of the gaming zone of the brain. Oh god, that's good. Sour cream, though. <coughs> it's, um... It's Naga Jalokia, like, it's, it's like ghost pepper sauce. Okay. Now I've got the devil's tendi tendies. Devil's tendies. You're watching a grown man eat his lunch because it's spicy. Dang, Rasuna Res Kairu, thank you. I buy some ice cream but flirt with the ice cream person. Ask for extra cream and wink as creepy as you can. I will do. I will do. Thank you very much. <sighs> Snarky doll, that's the one. That's what I've got. No, sour cream is on the menu, lads.
It probably will make me a, a goal. I am gonna fall apart, yeah. Finish your rice with pork and come watch the food stream to not feel hungry. Dude, you wouldn't want this anyway if you don't like spice. You want my chili? I'm at the glass house in Rotherham. Oh god. Ugh. <laughs> Dude, if you need to, <laughs> Dude, <laughs> if you uh, if you need to clear, <laughs> Dude, if you if you need a clearing out of your passages, this is what you get. Okay, are there any Asian gangs in Rotherham yet? No. Um, it's really weird, everyone's white here. I wasn't expecting it. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, I know it stains. It was a budget super dry, so it's fine. Okay. I'm gonna go allow myself. A little bit of sour cream. So Gordicus, thank you very much. That won't read out, but it says, Tim, I'm totally not a weeb, even though something, something. I can't see the whole thing. Sorry, dude, it's a, it's a five pound to make it read out. Now, those tendies were the weak ones, okay? <clears throat> those are the baby tendies. Those were the ones that didn't have much sauce. These ones are the ones the chef smothered. Absolutely fucking smothered. Okay? Ah. Uh. Oh, rather, right, I'm, I've, I've come to wherever the glass house is. <laughs> I used Google Maps. Okay, let's, let's see. Okay, I'm going to protect my face. Protective barrier on the chicken. Okay. There the way's me, right? <sighs> Protected. Protected. Rot her ham. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Bones and everything. Dude, a bit of it was on my lip and I thought it was my chin coming out. No. So, <clears throat> there are a bunch of chicken wings that I've gone through, and then there are chicken tendies. There are wings and tendies in this meal. Holy fuck. That did not protect me. Jesus H. Christ Almighty. Fuck me. That's bad. Future burning anus. I mean, why worry about an why worry about an inevitability at this point? Yeah, that one's still alive. <clears throat> no, I picked it up off the table. 
picked it off the table. That's quite cheap for ten quid. Did I get a drink? I didn't get a drink. No. Well, that would be cheating. The challenge. The challenge has a list of things you get, and includes sour cream. So I don't need milk. Yes, yeah, a tenner. This big plate of stuff. I haven't even started on the curry yet. It's a tenner. It's really good. And there's other stuff where it's like twelve pounds, and it's like a whole brioche loaf full of burgers and stuff. It's really good. Make more money if I admit my weebness. I don't think so. This is the sauciest one yet, I think. Yeah, there was some rice as well. It's good, right? It's good, it's solid food. What you want from a pub, yeah? To tell you the truth, though. Fuck me. My voice is slowly becoming more nasally. Uh, anyone who's like offering me a place, and I, I end up going to Meredith, if you would be willing to have me for like a night or two nights, I'd come hang out with you, and like stream during the day and like hang out with you or whatever, you can come come with me if you want and I'll buy some stuff, but as like a thank you, but like, it'd be, <sighs> it was like a gristle lump thing, gristle piece. Like, if you want to give me a base for, like, if I travel to you and stay there a couple days, I'd really appreciate that and I'd do something for you. Am I okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm getting high. I'm getting high as fuck. Not on drugs. Like, like you know when you have hot stuff, it makes the endorphins release? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I bet he would. Egg-scort. Not escort. Egg-scort. <sighs> okay, I can't go too slow because that's cheating as well. I mean, like, if we go to a restaurant, I'll buy you your meal or something. Right? I don't mean sex, I mean, like, buying you a pint. Jeez. Who think the guy cheat the cheese is probably shit? Um, excuse me? George Bush? Junior was a male cheerleader and he became president, so what are you talking about? Wouldn't mind a pint of semen, to be honest. <laughs> It'd probably be cooling. Yeah. Here's the plan. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna rail this poppadom, I'm gonna get rid of the rice. I'm gonna eat the curry with the sour cream. Pint of Louis C.K. semen, yeah. It's, a, it's at an all time low, it's, a, it's a, the cheapest it's ever been, okay? Ah. Uh. Okay, that's not right. There's a decoy. It's not crispy. It's chewy. It still tastes nice, but it was a bit of a surprise. Maybe they're homemade. Mm. See you, Gordicus. Thanks for dropping by. Okay. Nose, okay. I'll get the nose. That means they're stale, okay. That's a shame. That is a mark off. Okay, so it was a fly and they're stale, but it's cheap and it's tasty. Still better than Frankie and Benny's. How much semen do you th have you ejected in your life? Yeah, but if you what if you eat it afterwards though? Does it have to be like um Gross versus net? <laughs> gross load. <laughs> hey girl, let's talk about my gross load. 
Yeah, Dog Tower. I've heard about that. I'm going as late as I can to be able to go to the ice cream place before it closes and have like a spicy thing. I mean, it tastes fine. Um, texture is a bit weird still, though. Yeah, this is from a package. That it's out of date or something. They can't have emotions and feel pain and suffer. Why do we harm and kill them for animal products? Because they do not have moral agency. Noah, um, <clears throat> nor is their well-being protected by inherent duties people have. So, for example, a baby isn't a moral agent, but the baby is protected by the duty of its parents to care for it, or its guardians to care for it, and therefore other people may not interfere with that duty. If someone has a cow as a pet, then yeah, uh, that's different, but if you have it for food... Some people have no moral agency, can we eat them? I just described why not. Um, if you have a baby born without like a brain, like one of those brain stem only ones that are like a vegetable, I don't really give a fuck if their parents eat them, <laughs> to be honest. Like I really don't care at all if you eat that baby. I don't give a fuck what you do with it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> why does it matter? It's disgusting. Like I feel it, I feel like in the pit of my stomach, like revolted by the thought, but morally I don't care. Oh, you don't say hot food always makes your run, nose run like, dude. I can't read the whole thing. But thank you very much. It's a, it's, it's five to make it red out. I'm sorry, dude. You made it. You eat it. Yeah. There's a pro-life, pro-choice compromise. In order to reduce abortions, and we can get them for any reason, but they have to eat it. <laughs> Mangandrang, yes. Doesn't matter. I'm not. I'm not a uh, utilitarian, and I'm, I don't have a moral system based on um, <clears throat> based on like this thing gets moral consideration. No, I have a duty-based moral system, basically. Um. So, however. To inflict needless suffering on them, like it, to be excessively cruel. I mean, obviously, like systematic, systematically slaughtering and eating things isn't the nicest thing to do. But like, if, if you torture them and stuff, um, if you if you torture them and stuff, then that's fucked up. But it's like fucked up because it hurts you is the simplest way to put it. I don't want to go into the whole thing, okay? I want to go into the whole thing, okay? Did he base morality? You mean you're a Nazi? No, I mean I'm a deontologist even if that even is how you describe it my ethics are deontological not exactly a Kantian but uh, closer along those lines right um, you've been vegan for seven years so <clears throat> while I don't believe not killing and eating animals is a, is a moral imperative uh, if you just don't, like, if you just really hate the idea of eating animals, and you like animals, and like, like all animals with no exception, and you don't want any of them to be eaten or something, and you just, just you feel like an emotional connection or whatever, and you want to convince other people not to eat them, and you don't want to eat them yourself, uh, that's fair play, that's totally fine, to be honest, I don't mind that, however, I just, I don't think it's morally wrong. Um, okay. No washing the same set every day. No, no, no. I have I have an all new clothing because I have a room now. I have all new clothing. Getting into fresh clothing every day is good. Uh, let me think of something else. No problem with the moralized vegans. Yeah, but then there are also people who are like, oh, you have to eat meat, whatever, blah blah blah. There are some people who are like that. 
like maybe an overreaction to the moralizing of vegans, right? And like my whole thing about like, oh god, I don't want to fucking get into this while I'm burning my face off. Um, the problem with like torturing and causing pain for the sake of causing pain, uh, the thing that's wrong with that isn't the pain you've inflicted; it's that you're inflicting pain. It, the the animal's pain isn't what makes it wrong, it's that you're inflicting it that makes it wrong. And why you're inflicting it. Um, <clears throat> what makes it okay is for fulfilling, fulfilling a duty. Uh, so you're, you're doing it to, to feed people. It doesn't matter if it's not the optimum way or anything, but as long as you're not like causing, causing harm for pleasure, it's fine. Don't we justify if something's wrong by asking if we'd want that done to ourselves? Nope. Some people do. I don't. <clears throat> you can look at it a bit like that from there. Um, here's, here's, one, here's one way you can describe it to babies, right? If you want to do, like, babies... Babies first, why is it okay to kill any animals? Using the golden rule. The golden rule isn't shouldn't just be treat others as you'd want to be treated yourself or whatever. Treat others capable of making decisions, uh, rational decisions about how they will treat you as you'd wish to be treated yourself. Because uh, that, that cuts out animals that aren't going to be able to follow those rules that you're setting up. All right? Baby's first manual, murder manual, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, if you're going to go all social contracty, why would animals be involved? Why would animals be included, if that's your deal? If you're a golden rule dude, why would they be included? I was saying it doesn't matter if it's entire. It doesn't matter if it's it's perfect. It doesn't matter if there's an alternative to meat if the purpose of of producing it is to eat, right? It doesn't matter if there's a better way. Uh, it doesn't matter if you're doing it because you like the way it tastes. If it's fueling your life, then you're fulfilling a duty with it, right? Is this is a really retarded way of putting it? Catch me later, dudes. I'll do I'll do a video on it if you want me to. Um, but what I'm saying is like a more cynical take on the golden rule where it's like about setting up rules it's about setting up rules and anything that cannot adopt an implicit rule you can do whatever the fuck you want to it because it's not going to be able to follow your implicit rules uh, from, from treating it a certain way right when did pleasure become a dirty duty pleasure isn't a duty feeding people is feeding people and feeding yourself <clears throat> it doesn't matter if you pick that particular food because it, it's taste pleases you if you're doing it for food and you're not causing uh, suffering for the purpose of causing suffering I don't really give a fuck if it's to an animal obviously you can't do that to a person because they're a moral agent themselves uh, and pe like people people like vegans my problem is they never think outside of the fucking consequentialist box that they're uh, shitty utilitarian boxes are like well, if you're saying it doesn't apply to animals, what if an alien comes and it's very similar to us and it's intelligent? And it's a moral agent. Well, then, yeah, you don't kill them either because they're moral agents. <clears throat> it's literally, it's literally how society works as well. I'm telling you, look at how fucking society works and you will see. But it's not only prescriptive, it is also descriptive of how the world works. Why not I bought the Mex Utero? Uh, because there's a there's a duty protecting them. Because, like I said, my my ethics, uh, my system of ethics, right, is based on duty. If you bring uh, a being into the world that is capable capable of becoming a, a, a rational person, you've taken upon yourself the burden of of aiding them in in reaching that point. And the reason other people can't fuck with that person is because they're they're interfering with your duty. 
What if we eat the aliens before they can prove they're mortal agents? Then, like, too bad, dudes. You've been eaten. <laughs> uh. Lesser intelligence or lesser... You think I'd object if they started farming humans as lesser intelligence or lesser mortal agents? Uh, if they did that, that means I'm not objecting to my own system because they're using a different system. They're using a completely different system to me. If they're saying there's lesser moral agents. Uh, it's binary, dude. These are the two... <coughs> These are the two states of being a moral agent. You either are or you're not, dude. <coughs> so where's the line in neutro? Um... <coughs> Um, I'm one of those people who would say that abortion is a necessarily necessary evil. Like, I, I think it is, um... Maybe not even essentially more... I'm, gonna, I'm just going to put my hands up and say it's too fucking complex an issue for me, because... <clears throat> while you can go, uh, it's a life or whatever, and it has the potential to become a moral agent, and, is, and not only that, but it's likely to. I mean, you could say, Oh, but well, cows could evolve over millennia to be moral agents, the, the beings that are, have moral agency. Um, <clears throat> you got you got the baby on its way to uh, on its way to being born, on its way to being human, developing. But at the same time, uh, if you grant it that, if you grant it that, and all the protections, right? Uh, <clears throat> you then have to think, wait. This is a person and a moral agent leeching off of the inside of another human being. Can you force Can you force one person to have another person inside of them? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, legally, legally, I think the law works pretty okay. The law works pretty okay. Um, in terms of In terms of my moral system, it's quite It's a hard question because of the conflict, right? It's a hard question to figure out how it goes. I think, in ter pragmatically, it definitely needs to be a thing. Uh, oh my god, why? Here we go, chat. The trouble with <clears throat> the trouble with we school the trouble with the baby in utero is when does your duty to ri raise them to the point when does your duty to raise them to the point where they're a full rational agent and moral agent begin? Um, maybe part of the duty is is related to their ability to suffer, and you need to protect them from suffering on their way to becoming a full moral agent. So prior to the point at which they can suffer, that duty doesn't kick in. And while that duty doesn't kick in, it's okay to kill them because they're not a moral agent. There we go. I'm not saying that is the answer, I'm saying maybe that's why it works. I don't know. I can feel it in my throat, dude, Lieber gear. I feel it in my throat. It burns, boy.
tired of him being quiet. Done. No more chicken. I ate all the chicken. It's a chicken curry, okay? It's a chicken curry. I ate all the chicken, so I ate the curry. Look, that's just garnish. That's just sauce garnish. Fuck me. See, I ate all the chicken. I ate all the chicken. I did it. 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 Oh. Fuck me, why? What do I get if I eat it though? As far as I'm concerned, I've done it. As far as I'm concerned, I've done it. Why should I, why should I continue? I'm comfortable in my mind that I have not cheated. Okay. <laughs> Wanna drink? Nah, I got mayo. <laughs> I think it's unironically that's what I did. What do I get from eating the curry though? If I eat the curry, chat will be like, oh good, but you didn't add extra hot sauce. Chat will be like, oh good, but you didn't drink the bottle of vinegar. Uh, uh. <sighs> Think of all the hungry children. Think of all the hu yeah, that would end a lot of hunger. The children would start eating this and they'd kill themselves. Right? <laughs> the curry and drink the fucking bit. <laughs> you started unironically, you fuckers. <sighs> it actually tastes your heat for the sake of heat. It's actually tasty. It actually, it, no, no, it does taste good. Chat, can we come to an agreement? Go to Eggborough. That's near here. Yeah, I saw. Okay, chat. If I take... It is an eating challenge, but I wanted the like quantity, not the spice one. Next time, I'm letting you vote, but I'm not putting spice on that. How's that for a big pile of just the sauce? Just the ghost pepper sauce. No, 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 no what? No what? What are you saying no to, lads? Man, decent... Yeah, this is like a decent... Like, dude, you get like... Probably like eight chicken wings, like six tendies, like a big pile of rice, and a bunch of chips. Accepted. Okay. I'll even add a little bit more to it, okay? There we go. See, it's even bigger. It's even bigger. <laughs> that gay sauce eat the red thing. I think the red thing is a non-spicy chili. It's just decoration. Lots of seeds, dude. And I mean, the seed. I'd rather this was someone else rubbing my leg, but for now, this will do. The seeds aren't the spicy bits, okay? The membrane that's around the seeds is the spicy bit. Can I vote in the UK? Nope. I'll tell you what, I won't have any more of that sour cream. I can vote. I thought I wasn't allowed to. They was, I was told I can't vote. They're going to be real angry when I go to take a shit. They haven't been angry yet and my shits are pretty nasty. Because I'm, I'm just coming off of keto. So like my... 
my bowel movements are pretty bad. Just <laughs> if I'm going to be honest. All right, children, who wants ice cream? All right, children, who wants ice cream? Grossly offensive fights. Who wants ice cream, my boys? Kids, who wants ice cream? Oh, dang, thank you very much, Abathetic Cat. It's greatly appreciated. Congratulations on becoming a fried a fried egg, I presume that says. Sorry, dude, it's 500 bits to make it speak. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah, I did Hexathium. It seems similar to this place. Um, yeah, all right, kiddos, we're gonna get ice cream. We're probably gonna get messy moo. Another round of spicy. This was a good load of food as well. Besides being spicy, it was a good load to shove down your gullet. Um, pretty full. Like, it, as in, like, in in, norm, in normal terms, I'm pretty full. Like, if, if I was going to go for like a quantity challenge or something, I could do it. But spice cream, no. <laughs> I'm not doing the vinegar. I did finish. I I ate all the chicken and I had a scoop of the sauce, okay? I ate all the chicken and I had a scoop of the sauce, okay? That was actually really good. Uh, probably not as good as what Meredith cooked last night. Like she did like a massive pile of cheesy mash and like pork pork loin and stuff like that. That was real good. That really hit the spot. And like there was asparagus, which I haven't had in ages. Dude, if you're worried about things being bad, if you're I'm gonna wash, I'll wash my hands at the ice cream place. <laughs> I'll wash it on their apron, okay? Yeah, it'll, it'll... Fullness will hit me in a bit, I'm sure. What's this? Yeah, the connection's really good here as well. Oh. No, she doesn't microwave it. I watched. I watched. I watched her make the match. I offered to help if she said nah. <laughs> I don't know if she's being nice or if she doesn't trust me though. <laughs> Either way, hey, I didn't have to do anything, but whatever. Yeah, I'm not a UK citizen. I'm a foreigner. I'm a proper foreigner here. Um, living with living with uh, like a residency visa thing. Uh, wait, dudes! I almost left my speaker. I almost left my speaker. That could have <laughs> that could have led to some fun times, right? Let me let me let me slip this on. A scoop. We got what? Nah. Doesn't even help around the house. No, dude. I'm like saying. I'm saying like I'll take turns with stuff, but she, she, apparently she just does it. I got her an egg though. Did I tell you I got her an egg? She says it's good. I got her like a Godiva, Godiva special Easter egg. I can't see shit chat, it's too bright, it's too bright. You were telling me I'm too bright, you guys are too bright. Turn it down, turn it down, turn down the brightness. Uh, I'm pretty sure I know where to go. Like I think we have to just go up this road and go left at the roundabout and we'll get to the ice cream parlor, but shouldn't be too hard even if we get lost. What's my, wait, where's my reward? Nah, we're not that. This is this is the reward for the challenge that we're doing. Holy fuck, my stomach actually hurts. Fuck me. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually I actually feel physical pain. Um, there should be. Okay. All right. Basically, we know we're going the right way if I come to an ASDA. If there is an ASDA, we're going the right way. Wait. American version of a Mexi Dreamer. No, not quite. Not quite. Can't see shit. Alright, sorry dude. You'll be able to see some. You hope I die, why? Don't get an ulcer or whatever. Yeah, the, the, dude, the reward, the reward is I get, ice, uh, get a scoop of ice cream. That was very, very kindly paid for by you lads. Um, <clears throat> the, the restaurant itself doesn't do a reward for it. Like, they haven't, they haven't... Some places have caught on with the, like, American thing of having food challenges where you, like, get it for free afterwards or whatever. Or, like, you get a t-shirt. But this place just has challenges. Ha 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 ha. But they're cheap as fuck, so that's fine. It doesn't matter. Yeah, my fingers are red. 
dude. <laughs> uh, if you were to track me down, what was? Say it again, dude. I missed it. It's changing my voice. Uh, <sighs> I just need to be like uh, really careful about this because sometimes I get into a strange feel and my voice will change for like a week and I'll be stuck with the change well, yeah boy there's an Asda we're on the right way we're on the right way here we go Darty Why isn't this going? When you have sex, you there know that it might result in you getting pregnant, so you accept the responsibility of allowing the child to leech off of you while you're pregnant. You know that will be the outcome, but it doesn't matter if that's the outcome, if, if the baby has no um, right to it. Right? Uh, so, when you took a piss and... <laughs> When you went into this river without a condom on, you knew the kangaroo fish would get in your dick hole. So, too bad it lives there now. No, that's not the same. That's not the same. That's not a good analogy. But like, um, <clears throat> if the baby, um, if if, <laughs> why is there a duty to protect it while it's developing? Though? Right, it's written in nature law, not law, but you still have to decode it. Is that right, real? This place looks cool, but they're like closed on the weekend or something? Which seems not great, so I don't know. We'll see. Dude, I thought that said Staples Opinions, but it says Staples Opticians, whatever, it's fine. Oh no! They call fish stream when? What's it called? Is it is it a kangaroo fish? Does it usually protect a newborn even though it can't comprehend shit and shit? Yes. Because um <clears throat> what I'm saying is the bit I'm not sure about is so once it's born, it's like it's definitely on the path to becoming a, a moral agent and like a full person, right? And a rational being. Uh and it can suffer and everything. And you, you gotta protect it from things as it grows into that. Because that's the point at which. <clears throat> I think, what I'm thinking is, so the point of which is born and the point for some amount before it's born, you've hit a point where you can't dispose of it without causing suffering to something that has potential to become a moral agent. Well, it has potential before that, like you can't cause it suffering. It's the I th it might be the combination that does that, or maybe not. Maybe it's just always wrong. I don't know. It's hard, dude. Hmm. No dice. Oh, does it stop you? Like, look, Revolution Vaping Game. Uh, I said like, oh no, there's the there's the one. Moonwalk, the Chinese restaurant. What do you think of that? What do you think of that? I think we're going the right way. There's a micro pub. <laughs> I can't go in there though, I'm too tall. And I'm like, I don't know, so far I've been considerably taller than everyone. Are people just like shorter? Because like down, down south I'm like the same as most, same as a lot of people and then taller than some others. Here I'm just fucking taller than everyone. It's like I'm in Japan. Eat moonwalk, moon man. No, it's not even open. And I'm not, I, look, I, I'm, I can eat like a scoop of ice cream, I can't. <clears throat> I can't just keep going and going all day, lads. I can't keep going and going all day. Bald head is hard, be hard, you look like skinhead, be an egg, and you look like chemotherapy. Right. Northern lands are inhabited by hobbits. It does rather seem that way. That does seem to be true. So, yeah, I think it's further up. It should be on that side of the road. We're gonna find that the the ice cream place I saw. I think. <laughs> hey, but if I keep going this way, will I come across an ice cream place? Do you know if I keep going this way, will I come across an ice cream place? Nice. Is it good? Have you been there? Oh, sorry, man. I was just asking if it's good. Have you been there?
have you have you been there to the ice cream place? Where? The, the, the like ice cream place? The like uh, pastures mood? Do you know about that place? Oh no. Oh right, sorry man. Thanks yeah. for your help though. Uh, you're welcome. All right, have a nice day. Film in. Yeah, just myself. I just go streaming. Do you mind being on camera? Oh. Do you want to say hello? Yeah. All right. There are a few people. A few people watching, and they can yeah. see you right now, and like you can say hi or whatever. I'll call you as one of them. All right. I, <laughs> I suppose you get you. I. I mean, I don't understand it. I just stick it all together, and eventually it works. <laughs> and then, then once it works, just don't touch it again, yeah. <laughs> and then keep going. All right, man. Nice to meet you. Thanks for your help, dude. Okay. Right. <laughs> Isn't my head cold? No, no, no. I'm used to it. I've got uh, you know, like thicker head skin. It keeps me keeps me warm. All right, lads. You want to say hi? Yeah. There you go. It's just Twitch. It's live. Is it? Yeah, yeah. They can see it right now. warned me <laughs> that that would be the case. I mean like in the south there's some use to people having gadgets I guess. RIP stream. It shouldn't be rip. It's back. Is it? Is it gone back? I'm actually just walked into a dead spot dudes. Yeah, dude, there'll be there'll be dead spots and stuff. There's nothing I can do. Welcome to 19, 1992. It does feel a bit like that, right? Bad quality, but back, back, but picture. Yeah, it's it's outside my bag as well, so it's not overheating. I probably just walked into like a weak spot. <laughs> you must construct additional pylons, right? I think I'm going the way. I don't know why the old man said yes when he had no idea what. Maybe he's literally like, yes, what? Not like yes is an affirmative, that's correct. <clears throat> Wait, Lily Potts. I think I saw that, maybe? Could be wrong, though. Could be wrong. Chat, do I have stuff all over my face? That could be. Here we go! Here's the place. This is the place I want to go. Oh, perfect now. Okay, yeah, yeah, I must have touched a dead spot. Here we go. This is... This is the place. Pastures move. And there's their... Uh, there's their... There's their logo. I think, that, like, they, they deliver around, but this is, like, their, their main place. absolutely beautiful but I don't know if Whoa. okay we've got one Meg but like okay what can I do what more can a poor boy do like if I start walking the other way eventually you guys should pick up oh god I got it on my cable oh man that's real good my first taste was off my cable but Shit. Shit, what can be done? What can be done? The answer is nothing. Nothing can be done. This fucking sucks. Go. Double tap. Stream mode. Enter. Preview. Come on, man. No. Dude, I need to... I need to get somewhere where there's a connection. Oh, no, there we go, there we go, there we go. Left the shop. Dude, it was packed and it was noisy. It was, dude, it was... Chat isn't dead anymore. Chat isn't dead anymore, dude. It was packed in there and there's no, there's no signal over there. So I couldn't, um... I couldn't see chat. And it's like, there were just, there were just like some seats. That was it. It was like full of kids and stuff. If I can't see him, I'm just talking. What ice cream did I get? The flavor is their limited edition. Miss it now, never get it again. Hot cross bun. Only got one scoop, yeah? Hot cross bun ice cream. 
and dude i got some of it on my wire and licked off the wire and it's amazing it tastes like it tastes like perfect okay you ready Dude, that's really good. Fucking why? What do you mean fucking why? That's really good. Can you have some? Yeah, sure. Here you go. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, chat. If that made you uncomfortable, I didn't. I'd, I'd never. I'd never. Never do that on purpose. Okay, that's probably not good for my GoPro, but it should be clean now. Ish. Oh snap! Is it like cinnamon? Uh, it's got spices. It's got spices. Um, and it's got it's got like raisin. The spots are the spots are of like raisin. It's really good. Like like it's it's just like a hot cross bun that tastes perfect. The fuck is a hot cross bun? It's something you have in the UK and eat around Easter. Dude, it's real good. It's really really good. It's so good. And there's orange. Yeah, there's there's orange peel like. Um, Little bits of like candied orange peel type thing. Whatever. Look up a hot cross bun and the spices they use. It's so good. It's like the best hot cross bun I've ever had, but but in in ice cream form and even sweeter. I know I know I normally say I don't like things overly spicy. No, overly overly sweet. Overly sweet. I say I don't think like things overly sweet. But if it's spi if it's got spices, then I think that plays over it. Mm. Windy boy, I can protect you from the wind. There's no one about though. This is nice. Chat bought this for you. Yes, chat, you bought this for me. This is ten out of ten. I think you can order for them. It's called <clears throat> called Pastures Moo. Two pounds for a scoop in a cone. No, hot cross buns are good. Bad budget hot cross buns are bad because they're like normal bread with raisins. If you get like the Heston's, like Heston's hot cross buns from Waitrose are really good. Uh, or if you get them from a proper bakery where they use lots of spice, it's really good. And this is just like the best hot cross bun in ice cream form. Spice cream. Yeah, spice cream. But spicy not as in like capsaicin, but like spicy as in Easter spice. Hmm. Magic mustard, all, all the kids are already Nazis here. Mm. There you go. There you go, you can check out all these spices. Oh. Amazing after you've had fiery spice. Yeah, they've got a lot, a lot of the, all the spices and seasonings. Fucking top tier. Oh. Yeah. Since I've been home, yeah, the chat buys everything for me. Dude, chat's... Chat's literally given me a room without any rent. <laughs> and without any an ID. And is cooking food for me. So, fuck me. I basically owe my entire fucking life to chat right now. So, what do you want to see? Go a stash and be the hero. Well, like a little Hitler one, or what? Is that what you want? I could do it, but I think most people are most people are afraid of the 40s coming back. But uh, you never know what happens. We've got a couple, 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 couple thoughts, couple thoughts giggling. Look, yeah, look. I'm gonna thumb, I'm gonna thumbs up at them if they turn around again. If they turn around again, they're getting creepily thumbsed up. No, no, they're not turning around. They know better. They know better. You'll be a man, my son. Dude, that is... That's Rudyard Kipling. I left the place because the, the connection was killing. I, I didn't... The connection to my tablet died. I didn't know if it was... Thoughts of blocking 4G, yeah. Here we go, I've stumped it. I've stumped it down. Diros by thought magic. Let me throw this down, boys. And then we'll talk to people who think we're doing magic. You paid for me to awkward. I kind of did, ish, maybe. 
But I was worried that you guys couldn't see or hear. I didn't know. Kansas Stream Internet Cafe tomorrow, please. Maybe? I don't know if I can make it there, though. Hmm. I had a video reading it when I had a shitty setup and not a good voice. I can nose into it. I can nose into it. You gotta be a slaphead to survive around here, right? Hmm? Oh god. It's turning into dust. <laughs> um I moisturized it, I use normal moisturizer. Um Wait. Ah. Uh. Fuck me. I don't know if you could see, but the place was full of kids. Not what you want. <laughs> oh man. I read this as, uh... I read this as free red pills, but that's, enti that's something entirely different. Oh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Revenge of the fucking curry. Teasing cut. How did I tease you? I don't know where the spoons I mean, I can go there another day. Yeah, dude, I'm in Rotherham. Didn't you hear the, um... Didn't you hear the lad earlier shout that he's a pedophile? There is a really... sketchy-looking tattoo place that I'm afraid of, that I would not <laughs> even go inside. There's a late stream. Dude, I don't know what I'm going to do now. Can I grow a beard? Yeah. The thing is... This is my second feel out of the area. I'm getting I'm getting more and more comfortable with the area. Um <clears throat> What if like tomorrow? Okay, so here's the thing. Has the ice cream held my stomach? Yeah, I guess it has. I don't know if it did or if it was just me ignoring it at work. We'll see in a sec. So, like Right, here's the here's the deal. If I want to go somewhere fucking cool, like if I want to go to Leeds, uh, that's the kind of shit where I gotta go there in the morning, right? My hobo stubble, dude, I was still shaving then. Either every day or every other day. Too much area feeling, I'm sorry, tell them, tell them, show the Google map where you, where you touch you, right? Um, if I want to go somewhere like Leeds, it's gonna be an early stream. Leeds isn't cool. It's all right. What, dude? There's fucking little Tokyo there. There's there's some there's uni students there. Could go to a theme park. What I want you to do is like message me. Stuff up, stuff up north. You want to see? And I'll just go fucking do it and be awkward with people outside. I can do that shit no problem. As you know, my stomach isn't better. Holy fuck, that was a mistake. But the reward, I think the reward was even sweeter for it having been. Um, What's why? So I've known from chats poking me recently, but they might find me. Thought hunting? No, why would I go for uni students? Because they're, they're more likely to talk with you, right? At least I think. Go to Chatsworth. Is anything there, or is it just purely for the name? Do you want it purely for the name? Don't tell me that you- don't tell me you're that shallow. Don't tell me you're that shallow. How much do you think chat's worth? Oh, I don't want you to stop watching. If I give a value, <laughs> you'd be offended. I'm sorry. Why were you like weather spoons? Why were you annoyed about the weather spoons thing? Okay, me going past it. I mean, there's like hipster cans. Um, 
like very explicitly hipster cans, and these are the brands they got. Um, oh, God, yeah, that is, has hit my belly pretty hard, dude. Do I remember in High Wycombe, like, when I would play at Scorpios, it would be like six pounds a pint. It'd be fucking crazy. Why is this so cheap? And it's, it's fucking Brewdog, it's like, how is it so cheap? That's so cheap. Dude, I was taking, I was joking, Castleton Caves. Where are the Hellfire Caves? They're, no, they're in Wickham, aren't they? That's why I was, that's why I was thinking about them the other day. Oh, it does feel good getting back into making videos again. I haven't yet. I need to grab a microphone. I need to get like a Yeti, Yeti microphone, and they'll be good. Uh, or, or just use just use the GoPro Pro and do edit it up. Shipyard two forty nine. Bargain Punk IPA. I've had a hell of a lot of Brewdog Punk. Uh, I like it a lot because it's like a very light grapefruit flavour. It, I dig it. I like it a lot. Drunk Extreme when? I need a I need a break from drinking. Let's just I'm just gonna walk around and see if anything cool is there. There probably won't be, and I'll probably get lost. I need rescuing, but whatever is fine. Whew. Same bus has gone by. What with exactly the same people? Why don't we try to deal with it? Well, no, but what if I if I get absolutely just wrecked in the caves and it just doesn't connect? It's not going to be watching me deal with it. It's going to be watching nothing happen. <laughs> there, there just won't be a stream. That is one ghetto dentist. That's not where you. That's not where I want to have my teeth done. Okay. That's not where I would want to have my teeth done. So I think like if we don't want to go into Lamesville, we've got to keep going forward. Let's past his new, new, moo. Really good shit. We got humble cake and desserts, but I'm stuffed, and I'm not trying to do a. I'm not trying to do an eating challenge, so I'm not going to eat more. So it's fine. One adult walking with one alpaca, 24 pounds, we're in Ellsbury. Yeah, it's weird. Like, even if it wasn't half term, it's weird that no one's here. This is weird. <clears throat> that's where they lock you up and burn you. Maybe, maybe that's why I'm only seeing white people right now. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? Dude, there's, there's nothing. There's nothing. There's nothing. It's in York, okay. It's 3.45 here. Probably I can beat it by the weather spins, yeah. And there's a, there's a nice building. But... There's a nice old looking building. Yeah, it's just residential down there. <clears throat> and I think I think I just missed the bus. They would take to, take me to Rotherham Town Centre, where there's lots of shops and stuff. <laughs> Japanese school time, what are you saying? Yeah, but <laughs> they proper look at you like you're an alien. No, but like I think, no, I think they were like thoughts who are aware of Instagram and they're like oh there's a camera sort of thing pointing we might we might be able to get into some serious mischief soon if I take you out at night <sighs> not tonight okay why am I even here dude because I'm just walking around I'm seeing if there's and you know bombers and sun I'm just seeing if I can run into anything it doesn't seem like the kind of place we can run into anything so I'll probably end it soon we did spice challenge and then Ice cream reward. That's a nice little gem. That is definitely a nice little gem with the nice, nice ice cream. Um, glad to see a bald egg. Yeah, it'll be Snapchat. Yeah, night in Rotherham. Yeah, <laughs> there are a ton of there are just a shit ton. Like Rotherham Town Centre just has the retarded amount of pups. Uh, <laughs> it's what I noticed going through it. There are also a lot of ponies out and about. So uh, we'll see that. Maybe I'll just do. 
I'll tell I'll tell Meredith like I'm not going to be in for dinner tomorrow or something, and then go to go to Rotherham Town Centre at night. Night nighttime Rotherham. What do you think? Gang stalking stream. Gang stalking stream. Like fucking Rotherham a Rotherham pub crawl with chat stream. See if we can pick up a gang, pick up a pick up our own crowd and get it going and see what happens. Do it. <laughs> yeah, maybe I'll, I'll try and carry one with me. Blonde pigtail. No, it's not going to be a gang rape stream. It's going to be p- perfectly fine. Wait, what? What do you mean? Wait, what? Just go to go to Rotherham Town Centre in but on the bus at night. Get fucking wasted and try and get home. What do you think? <laughs> Some nice spots. Okay. Just don't relatively hurt the relationship you have with Meredith. I won't. The idiot box. The idiot box is Twitch now. <laughs> As in right now, only while I'm on it, I'm sorry to say. I'm, I'm, I'm ashamed of myself, but it's just the truth. And you can't hide from the truth. There's an all-day breakfast place. Okay. Presumably... Presumably, <laughs> that's the shop for the hospice, not the hospice itself, which would, that would be that'd be worrying otherwise, right? Yeah, there's a dead spot here. <laughs> no, I won't break the toilet. It's fine. It's fine, dude. I got um, I got ice cream to cool it down. Okay. Weeze is bad at identifying lollies and will end up in jail. Probably, yeah. <laughs> if we're gonna be, if we're gonna be real. Oh. Told me there's a jammer down here. Yeah, I think you did. I think you did, and you're not wrong. You're hundred percent correct. Do you want anything from down here? Do you want me to grab your ice cream? <laughs> do you want? Do you want? <laughs> Do you want me to grab you a cone and then get back as fast as I can? Ooh. What is a lolly even says Weasel? You could have been fucking them this whole time and not known. Oh god, this is where the stream is dying. It's just where I am. If 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 I did up last time I went down this way as well though. Fact. Yeah, just a dead spot. I'll be more careful about this next time. No, the toilet will not break. The toilet will be fine. I had spicy, but then I had ice cream. It balances, it steadies itself, it neutralizes. Okay. Okay. Police jamming the rape stream. Come on, man. <sighs> right, basically. At least it's voiceful opinion still. <clears throat> <clears throat> but... As usual, that's just another one of my ice creamful hot cross pinions. Alright, whatever. I don't know, that's bad. <laughs> Nuke Jammer. Oh, Millennium Edition. Thank you very much for the subscription. There's a, there's a labor building. Graspen. Graspen things. Thank you, everyone, for a big old salvo, please. The biggest of salvos. I almost did the thing. Okay. <laughs> I almost did the thing. So. Ruined it. I didn't do the thing? What do you mean? I don't even know what, what, what opinions thing, homie. <laughs> what opinions thing, homie? No, um. So, yeah, lads. This is just this is just another short tester stream. I'm getting a feel. I'm gonna tomorrow we're gonna go somewhere else that's interesting. Probably Tomorrow like this this was a me and chat stream. This is a me hanging out with you guys stream. Tomorrow Tomorrow I'm thinking of going to like Rotherham Rotherham Town Centre and just talking with people there about whatever. About whatever and getting in trouble and whatever. That kind of thing. Yeah. This was another tester, my second stream. 
My second stream in my new temporary home? Okay. Alright. As when things get rid of being grossly offensive. Anyway, chat. Uh, I will see you tomorrow with... I'm, I'm working at Cyber Cafe, maybe. Maybe. Maybe Cyber Cafe. We'll see. We'll see. But, um... Until then... Am I going to do streams later at night like normal? Yes! That's what I'm going to try doing tomorrow. I'm going to try to be in Rotherham, Rotherham Town Centre tomorrow in the evening and see what I can do for you lads. Uh, today I kind of had to do it earlier because I wanted to go to that ice cream place and see if their ice cream was good. <laughs> Which meant like making, a, making an excuse to turn it into a stream by like, getting the challenge stuff. Uh, is my long term goal to go to the States? I think so, but that's like a long, long term goal. I don't know how it's going to work out. I'll, I'll do something though. Right. Until tomorrow. Uh, good afternoon. Enjoy what you're doing. Don't let the spicy meats ruin. I'm gonna be making more videos. I've got this computer set up. I'm gonna be edit. I'm gonna, I'm going back to my room to edit more videos right now, and then I'll be get onto the original ones eventually. Okay. Right, toodaloo.